In this video, we are going to install the sprocket into the block. All right, so we cannot install the camshaft, tight the bolts without rotating this properly to the position. So I should have done that before tightening everything up and all that stuff right after I put the pistons in there, but I didn't. So what I need to do is, this is very cold outside, so this is uh, it's like shrunk, and I'm boiling the sprocket, and this is what we are going to use. We are going to use the guide and this here to drive this sprocket in place and a hammer if we need to I don't think we need to so this how it works is this sprocket has a little guiding side and we put this thing here which does nothing right it just stays in there and this sprocket goes over it alright so let's see how the boiling is alright so now you're mixing it's not a cooking show if I hope we don't try to eat this but anyway let's boil this for a while and I guess after boiling I'm gonna keep there for I don't know a few minutes uh, my cupboards don't have the door because it's gonna be like this we are painting anyway I'll be back it's boiling um, and I'm gonna turn it once more And yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna get the whole pan and take there, uh, and then do our thing. All right. So this has been there for like 20 minutes. Uh, I have no way to hold it, so I'm gonna do like this. Get this here, put it there, and try my best to align this and push. There's a line here, I think this is the line that I need to follow. So, the guide is right down there. It's right down here, I can't touch it because I'm going to burn my hand. Um, that's how you put this prog in your crankshaft. I saw a video, I don't remember the guy, I would give him the credit, but the guy just boiled it and just pushed it all the way. I... Uh, so my stove has a microwave on top and it and it uh turns on the fan when it's when it has too much heat because it's too close so i need to move the microwave another story and uh makes the water colder so now what we need to do here is watch the next video then you're gonna see um uh, what we are going to do to install this camshaft so hit the like button if you like it, subscribe to my channel, there's a lot of stuff happening. If you watch uh, one or two videos before this one, you're going to see uh, I have lots of stuff happening. Uh, seats for the BMW, drift car, um, and a bunch of other stuff. Alright, later.